All right, so a recent project we finished up, which I'm really excited by, I've waiting a long time for this, was our first Max installation um, for a conversion of a hard area. In this case, it was asphalt. So this was at a local school here, Indian Rocks Christian School here in Largo, Florida. And we've been working with those folks up there for quite some time um, in trying to get um, a synthetic turf area of some sort um, in this area to take um, away some of the concerns that they've got. They've got, they have a lot of rain, itch, a lot of rain and drainage issues um, in some of their small play fields. So what we did is we basically converted an old basketball asphalt area into really a state-of-the-art um, synthetic turf field, all with Ultra Base Max. Um, we shot a full video of the whole entire process from start to finish, uh, basically you know patching up some of the, uh, the asphalt, laying the panels out putting the turf in, a little bit of infill, and when we were done, it was, it's really, I, it's magnificent. With the G-Max is, you know, coming in average around 90, 91. Uh, it feels tremendous underfoot. We've had some athletes, some um, football players and soccer players on it. Um, I just can't, you know, I've been waiting my uh, you know, career to be able to, to bring something to you folks that you can basically go out there and install on top of virtually anything, whether it's old stone or compacted earth, or in this case, concrete asphalt, and convert it into a state-of-the-art facility with little to no effort. So that's what Ultra Base Max is doing for us. And um, look for the video coming soon. Please give us a call. We've got a lot of information on it. We're you know, creating a lot of um, test data, and we want to share all that with you. Um, and I think it's going to be a great um, project for us to really to to push the future of installations of synthetic turf, both for big and for small areas.